That was Lambeau Field and uh, Dallas Cowboys against the Packers. And uh, Vince Lombardi, of course, who passed away in 70, but he and I had an up and down relationship uh, from his first uh, championship in 61 all the way through. And uh, he'd always be mad at me, like uh, I mentioned the commissioner or whatever, that I would show him as a madman. And I said, coach, the reason I showed you on screen jumping up and down is because the ball rolled by your feet. Wherever the ball goes, I go. You know, there were perfect answers for him, but you know, it was a tough man for me to get along with. So, um, in this game here, um, the weather was atrocious and my cameras were frozen all over the place. <clears throat> and um, Dallas was ahead in the score and Green Bay needed to score before the time ran out and they were on the three yard line or something and they were coming into my end zone camera where Herman Lang had a Zoomer on Bart Starr, which was his assignment, close up of the quarterback, till he gets over the ball, then I would assign him, and I was going to go to whatever, $84 uh, a flanker, because I figured with the bad footing there, Starr wouldn't do a running play. He'd toss it to Dollar, boy Dollar. Well, Herman's camera froze, and he could never get it moving, and Starr decided to go over Jerry Kramer's back and push out Jeff and have Kramer push out Jethro Pugh, great player himself. So that became the famous replay of the, uh, I think that that was one of the key replays uh, um, that people have mentioned to change the, the way people look at games or whatever, that was a key replay because you, you really saw it, you really saw Jerry Kramer. And after that, Jerry Kramer wrote a book instant replay. He asked me if he could use the title. I said, sure, I don't have the rights to it. When I, I did Bart Starr's life, as I did other famous guys, and I asked Starr about it, and he said, well, I went over to Lombardi, and Lombardi said to me before the play, can Jerry get his footing on that turf? And he said, yeah. He said, well, go over his back. And that's how that happened. Um, but anyway, that replay was, uh, as Pat Summerall called it and whatever, it was because wasn't because of me, it was because the camera froze there.